acting. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And how to how to negotiate that without getting in trap? Because at the end, I do my paintings always come out kind of like illustrations. But what's wrong with being trapped, Rod? What well, is the resistance it's, to it's being like the trapped? It's like the chain. It's like the chain. Either leaning on the chain, they're seeing the shadow because everything's going on behind them. You know, the idea is to is to is to experience is to break the break the chain. It's the idea is to is to leap onto the wall, um, to experience the very thing itself, not to be outside the experience, mm. but to be inside it. And okay. I, you know, painters come and go through that process, but how to allow the painting to have a great say in the matter? How how to how to be moved by the painting? How to be surprised? How to not be the boss all the time? You know, but be a playful, interactive dancer with something that's going on. I mean, we all call and respond in our paintings. Okay, yes, I think I need to move the tree over. I, you know, my blues are too too awful. Or I don't you use know, blue. You know, honestly, um, the I don't know what you got to do. You got to mix tar with pigment, and you got to you got to take it in a bucket, and you got to dump it down, and then spread it across. Is that what you got to do? That's what you got to do. You know.